Hello guys and welcome back to Unity Dev Tutorials. This is Sonu Sharma and in today's video, what am I going to do is I am going to make a uh, camera script where the camera will not rotate beyond 90 degrees. Either it is minus 90 degrees or plus 90 degrees. And it will stop rotating whenever you stop pressing the arrow keys. So let's get started. First of all, and that camera script which I am creating here is will have to attach this to camera. Yeah, that's right, camera. So I'll name it as uh, camera R. And I'll open it in Mono Develop. I've already tested this script, so it won't pose you a problem. But still, you will have to be careful while writing code. So, first variable we require is public variable that to float, and that will be our rotation speed. Rotate speed. Uh, let's take it to 100. You can take according to your rotation. Again, public public variable load maximum rotation. That is maximum. Uh, let's get the minimum first. So minimum rotation that should be minus 90 degrees because we are limiting here. Public load max minimum that should be 90. Then private variable uh, float, yeah. Private float variable that is uh, rotation. This is private. Wait, Victorian will take Victorian and it will again come back to original rotation. So, original rotation, rotation. It's all for uh, variable deformation. Now we'll come to start. And in start, what we'll be having is we'll be having original rotation. What will be the original rotation if I stop pressing the arrow keys? So original rotation, which is equal to transform form dot local rotation. That is local rotation. This is done. We have declared it in start. Now let's go to update function. Update function rotation will be what we have declared is a rotation. Rotation that is equal to uh, rotation that is equal to so it will start in delay. So that will be plus equals input dot get axis then it will take horizontal rotation so let's write horizontal into yeah, into rotation speed rotation speed here into time dot delta time delta time that's how it goes. Now we have declared rotation. Now what exactly rotation is that we also have to define and we'll also have to define that will define later on. Yeah that will define later on. Let's get transform here. Here we have taken local rotation. So what that basically is transform dot local rotation. So transform dot local rotation which is equal to original rotation into Victorian yeah uh, the 
एंगल एक्सिस एंगल एक्सिस एंड व्हाट दैट एंगल एक्सिस विल बी दैट विल बी ब्रेकिंग इन टू थ्री पार्ट्स फर्स्ट विल बी रोटेशन Yeah, rotation. Then it will be vector three because it's it's in vector dimension. Vector three dot up, and then now this is done. Let me save it. Now we'll have to define a function to clamp the angle. Right, because we are moving it till 90 degree in positive direction and till 90 degree in negative direction, so we'll also have to clamp the angle. Otherwise, it will be moving all the way around 360 degrees. So let's write public float and clamp angle. And then, and what parameters it will have? Is float value of angle comma uh, float value? Then it will have minimum maximum length, right? Float value of min and float value of max. That's all it will have for now. And then what we'll do is. We'll define. We've already taken the parameters. Now we'll set the angle. If angle yeah of that angle. So parameters parameters angle angle mm -hmm. is uh, if this angle is less than minus thirty three sixty degree minus three sixty. Dot zero f because it is low. That's why f is necessary. And what if what if the angle is less than minus thirty six three sixty degree? So then the angle should 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 come to plus equals plus equals three sixty. Ah, okay. Three sixty dot zero f. That'll be all. And what if, if this is the positive side? This is the negative side. And what if the angle is positive? So let me just quickly copy this. Quickly copy this, and let me paste it here somewhere. And instead of this taking as negative, we'll take it as positive. And if it is greater than 360. So the angle will be angle uh, will be in negative. Oh yeah, what's that? <laughs> uh, I I will click means a sixteen. Is it right? Close the braces and then what it will return is it will return return as max function. <coughs> Sorry, clamp angle. And what that will be? We've already defined in the parentheses that will be angle angle from a minimum. Our max. So this is what it will return. Let's save it very quickly. Yeah, and I don't go on the scene, right, guys? Because this has been downloaded from the asset store. This I'm working on another game. So. so you don't have to worry about to have the same scene as the game. And that's the camera here, and you can see the public variable appear. So let me play. Yeah. 
So whenever I click to the right arrow button, it is moving. Yeah, but it is not clamping. I don't know why. Yeah. Because we have defined the function, but we haven't applied it, right? We have defined clamp angle here and we haven't called it in update. So let's call it in updates after rotation. That rotation will be rotation. Yeah, rotation will be clamp angle. Clamp angle. Our function. And in that clamp angle, there will be a parameters. That will be rotation, rotation, comma, minimum, comma, maximum, all this. That's all. Hit save and hit key. Sorry for this. Now you can see that whenever I click the right arrow button, the camera is moving towards the right, but it is not moving beyond 90 degrees. In similar way, whenever I click the left arrow button, it is moving towards left, but it is not moving beyond 90 degrees. So if you want this script to work as you want, that is, if you want the minimum angle to be minus 20 or something like that, you can. Do it from here. I am part of my spelling is here. Right? So that's all. This is a quick camera movement stick. Till 90 degrees. So if you have any doubt, guys, you can come up quickly and ask me in the comment down below and ask me what exactly you want. I definitely try to help you out. We definitely try to help people out with the description on that. So if you haven't subscribed my channel, please subscribe. Hit bell button so that you don't miss any of the videos made by Unity Web Tutorials. Yeah, and we also have a UPSC tutorials who are aspirants of civil service examination in India. So we have uh, another playlist for that also. So please do go and watch out. Thank you guys. Thank you.